Hello and now is the expla explanation part. So uh, I want to just show my my Coil Spring bully bow with the let off. So the design is completely new. Here we have the springs in this way, so I can uh, pre-stretch with with the screw. Uh, I mean screw. And here we have also a moving pulley, which actually I didn't first first it I didn't um, try to do it, but then I have to do it. So, like I told you, there is many many things. Uh, the white pulley here is a synchronization pulley. Actually, I didn't know that I needed them too, but I then I know that I need it. Well, anyway, I have make many many different pulleys. Uh, like I told you, I take a picture of of Liberty One compound bow, and uh, the picture was uh, the. Uh, I print it to the paper and then I saw these from plastic. Uh, these are maybe these are bigger than in the Liberty one. But then when I made these actually I used a new technique. Uh, these are two different sheets and then I make a little groove in here between them and there uh, it's a big hole where I put a knot and then I squeeze squeeze these together with screws uh, so the string won't move nowhere but this system was of course wonderful and, and, and stuff but then I realized that the picture was not right this will pull 20 centimeters of uh, spring but the only what I can do is to pull 10 centimeters so I have to make a new one so the new ones what are in the place they uh, they are little the, the smaller pulleys are, are smaller so there is, there is only place for three screws then I was happy and uh, I was pulling my my gun but then I noticed that I underestimate the force of the dark side and the spring is definitely from there so I couldn't pull that's why I had to make this moving pulley which uh, reduces the force with two that means it divides with two so if uh, I need for example 50 new newtons uh, without it then I need just 25 newton newtons so that's why I had to change my plans again and again then I was ready to shoot but I noticed the synchronization system uh, these cams the another one was letting off and another wasn't so I have to make some kind of synchronization and th this is very simple just put two pulleys and they have to uh, these strings must be this way so if this is pulling the string up this is giving it to town and here is this is pulling this another is giving so it's pulling and then this side is giving so it will work uh, of course I first of all I I couldn't pull so of course I tried another way I make uh, more smaller pulleys and here you have you can see some kind of little hole for the knot but these pulleys has just one disadvantage you see it's so small that I can put only one screw and when I was pulling it launched uh, now I know why that or where the English word spring comes from I was pulling and the bow says
Bring. And I know, knew that something broke. Uh, one screw is not enough. It cannot hold two pulleys together when I have a much force in it. But now, it worked. Well, uh, some way, anyway. Uh, someone wants to know how much force it can handle or how much it is I don't know actually uh, the penetration is so less that I think it's just 20 pounds or something but anyway if you are trying to make this kind of thing do not uh, waste your time to making some cams or something these are not good uh, it is uh, for example it's much easier to make a bully and you can make always bigger and bigger if you make these cams you have to make the crew for the string uh, by hand of course but if you are making pulley you can use lath and uh, it's very simple and very quick but well, I just wanted to know, can I make some lead off and now I know that I can, but actually, I maybe I want to try the older one, which is better. <laughs> well, thank you anyway. Bye.